everyone. <laughs> I'm very, very cool, very. You know what they say in life, eh? So no, nobody is 100% useless and nobody is 100% good. That in every one of us, there's a little bit of good and any harness. And sometimes, uh, it, it depends on which one is more and in what quantity. That's what defines someone as how the person is. Nobody is a total failure. Nobody is a total success. People have their good and bad parts and all of that. So I was speaking to someone earlier and then he mentioned something that was very, very interesting. He said T-Pain has given a lot of content uh, creators, you know, things to create, to have something to do their content with. I laughed there. It was just so funny. And it was just like, okay, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. it's quite interesting because we were watching a particular, you know, content creation where someone had the, uh, he was eating, you know, that kind when you're eating, you just use the this thing to wipe your hand. And the next thing, the waiter came to carry the food and he gave the person bombastic side eye criminal offensive side and you know those kind of side eyes that you give to a person and it's just so crazy so i'll just look out i just started laughing i said it's true because right now you have a lot of a lot of people who are doing different content creation different things you know just using tp the most interesting part of it uh, ah yeah 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 is if you go to facebook ah how's that facebook over there they are on another level but come to people think about it there is one thing that people have been doing eh? though it's funny it's annoying at the same time sometimes i'll look at the thing and we laugh eh? then i'll look at others i'm like what kind of human beings are we in nigeria we just use humor to to uh, to mask any pain and any suffering we are going through i think that's that seems to be our coping mechanism did you see the different kind of pictures, uh, or is it pictures, I should call them, or drawing, or manifestation, or whatever, that they have been doing of uh, T-Pain? Hey! There is the Voldemort T-Pain, there is a uh, Hitler T-Pain, there is a, uh, in short, uh, the T-Pain thing, just full ground. I'm going to list all of them, you'll be seeing the different, 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 you know, pictures that are out there that people have just created for them to be able to have this thing where they will just laugh and just move on, you know, with uh, their, their issues and not just handle or tackle the issues the way that they're supposed to be. As much as it's a good thing to be able to have a coping mechanism so that you don't, you can stay on and keep going, it's actually also a good, a bad thing. Because at the end of the day, what seems to happen is that we are actually running away from the situation the way it is. We're making it, um, we're turning it into a joke as if it's really nothing. Meanwhile, it's something that is affecting every one of us and people are really going through so much. There is an extreme hardship in the country. And for me, one of the things that I find very irritating is how people also don't understand that everybody is going through this hardship. No matter who you are in Nigeria, your wealth in Nigeria, except if you have money abroad, or all your investments are abroad. But as long as whatever it is that you have in Nigeria, your wealth just came down. In short, it's sort of like halved. And then you find people who are who come to you for help or who are happy. They are not understanding that the person is you already first of all carry your own problem. You are angry that you are carrying other people's problem. And then the person is there, you know, just coming to uh, put more pressure, pressure, pressure on you. And like, I need to understand it, that the way you are going through it, the other person is also going through it. The other person's own is major. Imagine in this, in this economy, somebody having to pay 25,000 uh, pounds as school fees. Then you, because they are helping you with your own school fees, that it's like 100k or whatever, you've been disturbing that person, disturbing that person, disturbing that person. You didn't even do anything to even help yourself or even put something there. And then you don't understand that that person too is running mad because they are also looking for money to pay those fees that they have. And they don't have anybody that they are going to call upon to help them in any way. Ha! <sighs> Niger matter. Things they happen, things in short, the things that you just look at, like, oh my goodness. Ha! Especially citizens who are sitting down, waiting for God to come and do something for them. Those are the ones for me that get me the most annoyed. You're talking to someone, the person is saying to you, hey, it's only Nigeria that can fix the problem. Okay, no, Allah. Then why are you bringing your problem to me? Eh, sorry, not, it's not, not it's only Nigeria, it's only God that can fix the problem in Nigeria. 
And then I'm wondering, why are you then bringing your problem to me? The God that can fix the problem of Nigeria, you think that, that same God will not fix your problem? God will fix all of our problems. So why are you taking action on your own problem and not taking action on the nation's problem that affects everyone that ends up affecting you? But you see, eh, until and unless that, eh, what do you call it now, um, eh, selfish mentality, we do away with it. I know some of you, your pastors, your mothers have told you that eh, you'll, be the, you'll be the richest of the richest and the rest of us will be coming to beg you for food. That thing is a fallacy. Ah, you will die. You will die poor waiting for that thing to happen. Look what happen because you will be the, among the people that will be that will be begging. Very selfish mentality that people have. If it is one person in the community that is rich, nobody is rich. Everybody is poor. Even this Nigeria will be that they tell us all of us are poor people. You carry your 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 twenty twenty five latest model car. Some people are already tw driving twenty twenty five edition in twenty twenty four. But guess what? They are entry bumpy roads. The road is going. Before you know, after they cannot travel from one end to another. They can There are some men. Eh, what they do is that they will put the car in this this thing to carry. For example, you want to travel from Abuja to Kano. I've seen some. They carry the car eh, in trailer or whatever and take it there. Because you can't drive it on the roads. The roads are not good. Even where the roads are good, the kidnappers or whatever are waiting for you. And then so you do your small this, you have to be holding millions that for ransom. At the end of the day, all of us are suffering. But it seems as if many people just think that, oh, let's just continue life the way it is. Let's just be making fun. I get it too. I get it. But at least, yeah, on a brighter note, uh, content creators are able to get content. And hopefully when those contests make something, they're able to get money on social media. And this money, of course, they too will not also be able to use it for their for, to, to take care of their expenses. So it's actually another way of living. So in other words, should we say that T-Pain has created jobs opportunity? <laughs> Somebody is laughing behind the camera. At least eh, we will say that T-Pain has used his pain to create content, content and material for a lot of people. So now people can easily see those content and do about it. What other picture of t pain have you seen? Can you put them in the comment section? Oh, you can't, can you even attach comment uh, to this, uh, pictures to this thing? I don't think so. But then you will laugh at all the hilarious pictures that are come. The creativity of Nigeria is just so amazing. And just imagine if we have good governance, accountability, transparency, if we have enabling environment, if we have rule of law, if we have, you know, just opportunity to be the best. Just imagine what Nigeria will be. Thank you so much for watching and bye.